If blood ain't right, then I couldn't be wrong I'm a bad motherfucker, be very afraid Boy, this heat to get your ass a red berry beret Been in the building, motherfucker, we ain't never escaped Cash money is an army, better respect Wait, little Wayne, I was me and my mate real quick, I'm gonna end it right here Was at the Damu Chai Week I was fired up because Wayne was on the front cover of Rolling Stone magazine what if Pac, what if Snoop? He he was doing a blood ritual. Now, if you if, if you if you blood, you saw Lil Wayne on one of those cover, you knew what was happening. Yeah. He had his finger like this by his by his side, the red red the red red right to the to the right side. His finger like this. The camera zoomed up and said M O B and said Power right here and said Damu over that. Now, whether you thought he was real or not, he was communicating like I communicated. But other than that. Keep them real ones paid, real talk, because that's that's the street code of the streets in Southern California when you ain't thumbing and doing something that you know you ain't about. Oh, like I said, everywhere I went, ain't nothing I'm repping up to, I'm repping up to, I'm ready to up anyway. When I do that, like, hey. And then shout out to my little brother, let me not forget my little brother, Capito from New Orleans, Eastside. We call him Capito for good, so he be with me back here, he be with black Wall Street, you feel me? He's a little brother, 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 he's a little you were terminated, you know, I mean, all of them, my little brother. But he, you know what I mean, they took him in, for real. Um, so, I got every reason for that. Whoever I'm feeling, whoever I'm like, you know what I mean, I got every They took my little brother when I couldn't. You feel me? They made sure he was straight, you know what I mean? And he's straight to this day. They ain't trying to beat them niggas up, man. They act like they banging, nigga. Let's bang, nigga. This rips, nigga, on that song, nigga. Why why was their cars there in LA? They were shooting that little bitch ass circus video with two T Pan. The circus shit. With, with the niggas jumping out of niggas' mouths, yeah. You got men coming out your mouth, what the fuck, man? But you all right, girl. <laughs> fuck, ass. All these, little, these niggas little Ryan running from us, man. The one thing you keep hearing was, oh, Wayne wasn't in that car. They, they said they, they want to know if it was really Lil Wayne. Baby wasn't in that car. It, it, it was just like a, an act. Like, you know, all the yeah. people surrounded some random cars and said that Wayne was in there because you never saw Wayne. Come on, crack the window. What's up with that blood shit, low? Now, it's right there. See him vividly. You know, jumping from seat to seat. Third seat, right. second seat, front seat, to the back seat. You know what I mean? <laughs> Hopping on the cell phone, calling 911. Yeah, again. Right. Oh, my God. You know, you know what I mean? What the fuck was up with that, 40? I mean, you know, that was on the gangbang aspect of it. Like, the street life disrespecting Southern California. Uh... Gang culture like Crips, Bloods, and so forth. Like mm -hmm. we got niggas that didn't die for this shit. And really, a turnover in their grave and letting somebody come through and play with it. Like we kill each other over it. What make you think you gonna come in here disrespect Crips? Just what happened yesterday, a nigga called me and told me that uh, T-Pain and Lil Wayne was shooting a video real close to where, where I was at. So I'm like, damn. What's up, cuz? Yeah. If they would have some reptiles with them, some reptiles would have jumped out. Like, wait, hold on, 40. This, this, woo 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 from woo de woo woo, homie. Like, what, let me, let me, what these niggas didn't do. Do you say so, bro, so, bro, so, bro, so, bro, so, bro. Hold on. It's some little bitty ass, it's called a kite phone, and we get sponsored by them. I ain't got it on us right now, but it's something like these Blackberries, you know what I'm saying? But they low ass phones, they high tech. And a motherfucker was live. The stream was going straight to this is 50 live. Everybody was watching it. They 
got to pay. On world stuff. Yeah, so they got to pay. You know what I'm saying? When they come, they better kick cheese to the real street niggas. Since you want to do that, you're going to pay the real street niggas. Because in the day you stop paying them, they gonna be on your bumper, and you going and we gonna still be, we on your bumper regardless. Yeah, so as yeah. soon as you ain't with them, <laughs> you ass out anyway. And if you is with them, and we catch you like that, then we'll handle it whatever way it goes. You know what I'm saying? Don't push, don't push. 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 Nah, man, I'm making my money, man. You in the public eye, brother? What happened in Compton though when they had you on the block? What happened that day? That wasn't real, right? If, if the camera wasn't, wouldn't have been my live stream, if I would have just recorded that shit and edited it, you would have got to see me. Because the windows wasn't that dark, but it was so pixelated, it was it made it look, you couldn't see inside, but you could see some time inside, you know what I mean? And it was all the niggas. It was two cars, you know what I'm saying? It was all the niggas, but... Nigga wasn't with me. I'm glad it didn't go to that point where we, we busted out the windows and all that shit because it, I probably wouldn't, I wouldn't be doing this interview right now. So it's kind of, but we got our point across, you know what I mean? And it, yeah, it was hella guns out there, you know what I'm saying? I think it's just like, a nigga just being confused with the, uh, the little boy Wang, like, his whole little approach for a minute, like, Nick confused about the sexuality for one. Uh, for one, me myself. Then on top of that, Nick confused how a nigga becomes a successful black uh, entertainer and then all of a sudden start throwing around red rags. So hard, extra out. And then on top of that, and then we used to, from what I can see, what I've derived, do the same thing with blue rags, but not quite as extra out as he is now. You think you're going to walk around the, the soil that we. We died for just walking on the wrong block, for having on the wrong hat, the wrong color. My money lies longer, if blood ain't right, then I couldn't be wrong. I'm a bad motherfucker, be very afraid. Boy, this heat to get your ass a red berry beret. Been in the building, motherfucker, we ain't never escaped. Cash money is an army, veterans day. But the black man got hotter, the world and got colder. So fuck the diamond chain, we wearing guns. On our shoulders, if you want it, you can get it. Come on, sign up. We got choppers there to put that Tony Romo nine. You know what I'm saying? And we lost mamas, babies, sisters, cousins, grandmas, like like generations in this shit. And you think you gonna play with it just to gain some celebrity status? And you already got celebrity status. Now you're just playing with it because you feeling yourself. So what about Lil Wayne? Is he a real blood? on the scene, the rest of that Chris, Valley Cribs, Valley Gangsta was out there. And so Wolf Gang is, dead. if you ain't with it, you fool change. So like, to me and every Crip nigga I know, that shit initially sound like he was dissing. Like, that's like shit that like, you know what I'm saying? Look, man, you Birdman, I mean, with the rags and shit, I mean, then you got money, what's the purpose? You know what I'm saying? What you do, what you prove, you ain't proving nothing to nobody, so run around with a red rag, he wasn't running around with a red rag yelling, shoot you with blood and this, now when you first came out with, with your, with your, with your, with your bandana on the right side, east side until I die, yeah. that it change like a smile to cry, and we pull guns like quick draw my crowd, see I'm from New Orleans, Louisiana, and he's from Compton, raise your bandana, we carry them caskets, we tote them hammers, shoot to the boot, yeah, that's our grandma, let me hear you say, so woo. So well, so well. 
Uh, Wayne, this, Wayne says it every freaking song. Yeah. He says it in every, what are y'all thinking about? He says it in every song. Yeah. Every song. Like, there's no, he'll say it on a love song. He'll say, baby, I love you, baby, so welcome to the blood game. Yo, yo, yo. <laughs> so my love song, he just say love. It's a, it's a pop record, he doesn't care. But what's happening is that he's continuously putting this divide. Right. And the set trip is growing because now little group kids feel they have to over-assert themselves now in the club parties, in, 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 the, in, the, in the school facilities. Right. Right. And you know, come to the PG thing, they feel like they gotta be aggressive now to let me know I'm not that, I'm this. Here come these two happy cartoon characters coming with this shit, rags and shit, trying to turn shit into a fad, you know what I'm saying? And you really, you disrespecting us. And then you making this songs disrespecting us, you know what I'm saying? And, you know, we felt like we, we wanted a public apology. We wanted an answer for it. And we, that's what we went to get. The street is called the street taxes. For niggas like that, when they come into Kelly, of course, because we highly gang bang, uh, gang orientated, like highly in Southern California. I mean, the stakes are 100%, you know what I'm saying? So you want to roll around comfortable. Yeah, you got to pay some real ones. You got to pay some real dudes, real street dudes, not just... You know, the, the dudes in the limelight, you gotta pay the dudes that's behind the scene to be with you. That's why you ain't hearing too much about it. Yeah, niggas ain't gonna speak on that, nigga. It's gangster shit over here, nigga, we ain't playing. So they, they stepped in the wrong realm, my nigga. They was playing in a field that they don't know nothing about, my nigga. So it, it, it a damn show for sure get they, get they mind right, you know what I mean? Cause nigga, I fuck with Crips and Bloods worldwide. You know, they gotta pay them. And they been paying them, you know what I mean? So, like what I did to them, got some, some real reputable bloods, they got them some good checks because at the same time when they came there and they got caught slipping like that, they knew they were supposed to have and been paying them, you know what I mean? But they didn't want them bloods with them because they didn't want to pay no cash, you know what I mean? They didn't want them to know they was in town so they didn't have to call them to pay them to roll with them and so forth on, you know what I'm saying? And and so they tried to, they was so happy they got caught slipping without them that day. The hardest nigga in y'all in y'all shit is that uh that fact that bitch Nicki Minaj that bitch shit she's trash. What he is trying. So next we gonna hear. So next we gonna hear Bow Wow saying so. I like I like I like Nicki Minaj. Man, so just went in on Nicki. I like hey baby. Hey, he just baby. You know he just because he don't like them niggas. We I like them. You know what I mean? Just get away from them niggas though, cuz them niggas, mo they more bitch than you. Like you got, I see, I watch hey. her, and she she got more nigga in her than them niggas, you know what I mean? Nigga had this nigga in her, all of the niggas. Times this old as it is, that's why I got guns and my gun got kids, that's why I be going so tough on them. I play my own hand, I don't shuffle them. <laughs>